What's going on everyone? Colby here with Colby's Cards and today I'm opening uh, the last half of the last parts of my birthday gift. So uh, one of these Series 2 blasters. Um, again, I did get these for my birthday, so super excited about it. I'm uh, just going to go ahead and get right in. I'll show you the odds real quick on the side of the box, which you can see right there if you would like to pause and read them. Um, so yeah, definitely excited for this box of Series 2. Probably one of the last boxes of Series 2 that I'm going to check out, just because I'll be saving my money for um, Tops Chrome, which is coming out. Um, I always like Archives, which is not coming out for quite a while, but regardless, still some other products to come out later in the year. I know that uh, they keep getting pushed back, which is somewhat unfortunate, so definitely not a fan of that. Um, I'm going to go ahead and skip through a lot of the, not skip through, but at least kind of go pretty quickly through a lot of the base here. Um, so, of course, they're all flipped the wrong way. Uh, we do have an Aaron Judge 90, or 87 All-Star card. And then we also have our Stars of MLB, Ozzy Albies. I'll kind of set these off to the side. I'm going to put them up here just for now, but... Um, Stars of MLB, we're going to get one of those in each pack. We do get a couple of rookies here as well. Um, if you haven't seen it yet, I'm not sure when I'll post which, but I did buy one more hanger box of Series 2, and I got a couple, I guess, you, I mean, a couple short prints technically. Um, this actually looks like a different image, but I don't think it is. Nope, ends in 47. Uh, regardless, I got a short print which was amazing. I've been hunting for short prints, as many of you have as well. So I finally got a short print out of Series 2. Um, and then I also got a uh, another parallel that was pretty tough to get. One in 695 were the odds on that. So super excited to have gotten that. Um, here we have a uh, Pick the Game, which is one of those home run challenge cards of Vlad Jr. So I'm going to go ahead and make sure to put that in pretty quickly. Uh, as the season is coming to an end. And then we have our Stars of MLB, Adolis Garcia. If anybody's trying to put together the set of the Stars of MLB, of MLB cards, I can never say that right at the first time. Stars of MLB. Um, let me know because I've got a ton of those cards. So certainly let me know if you're trying to put together the set. Happy to uh, send them your way if you'll pay shipping at least. Uh, but definitely happy to get rid of some of those. Not get rid of them, but, you know, consolidate my collection. Uh, we have a no-hit club of Mark Burley, so that's pretty sweet, against the Tampa Bay Rays back in 2007, so quite a while ago. Uh, and then J.D. Martinez is our Stars card. And then we have a Brandon Woodruff, Shane Baz, excuse me, rookie card, Zach Plezak, and Yusei Kikuchi. I still have yet to pull, which, I mean, obviously is super tough. Uh, an autograph out of a Series 2. Um, oh, we have, oh boy. We have something backwards. I don't know if it's going to be numbered. I don't want to look, but we do have something backwards. And it's in the middle of two inserts. So everybody, everybody hold on. Everybody calm down. Everyone else is calm except for me. I'm the one sweating, but here we are. So... We'll see what we get here. Um, I've not seen this card very much. Uh, River San Martin, San Martin maybe, and then Nathan Evaldi. So we have a Chrome, first of all, of Adolis Garcia. So that's pretty cool. And then we have another Stars card on the back, JT Real Muto. Put them both over here, but holy smokes. So it's numbered. It's numbered at a 499, so it's not a short print. Um, I think it's going to, is 499 the green? Boom, we have a green. So I got, I got a little excited. I got excited about a short print. Obviously it's shorter printed, uh, but it is not like a short print. Uh, but still a sharp looking card there in the green. Put that over here. I'm not like ranking these in any particular order, just kind of putting them up on the uh, so-called stage, but we'll do this, keep all the stars cards together. Well, that was exciting. Um, nerve-wracking yet exciting but still got the numbered card in a blaster box which is always fun i'm going to do the same thing pull these off the back so we got packy Naughton, 
Still a wild last name, just a wild name, generally speaking, and I kind of am here for it. Uh, Garrett Richards, we got Justin Bruhill, Brule, I guess you'd probably say it as. Reese Hoskins, uh, but like I was saying before we looked at that, or saw that flipped card, um, I have yet to pull an autograph out of any of the <laughs> many, many boxes of Series 2 that I've opened. Um, George Springer is a stars. Uh, we, I'm trying to think, did I? I did get an autograph out of one of the silver packs in my hobby box. So that was back, that's on the channel, so definitely go check that out. Um, but otherwise, I've not seen, I've not really seen too many autographs pulled from retail. Maybe just a few here and there, but mostly out of um, hobby, as it kind of what is always, you know, or should be. Um, but still, haven't really seen too much of that coming out of retail. All right, so we've got a blue Boston Red Sox card, retail blue exclusive. Um, uh, I'm going to move these stars cards because they're annoying. We'll put this over on the side just because everybody gets them. Like, we get it, tops. We don't need any more of these. Um, I'm actually, I'm looking forward to hopefully they get rid of those. Maybe an update. I, I kind of doubt it, but at least, I don't know, in other releases, they'll be, they'll be gone. So kind of excited to say goodbye to those. Um, alrighty, so we do have, there's my guy, Packy Naughton, rookie card again. Frank Schwindel, Cole Tucker. Uh, we've got a Matt Brash as well. There's Jack Lopez. So we are going to have our manufactured relic in this pack. Um, excited to see who that is. Hopefully somebody that I have not pulled yet. There is Daniel Vogelback himself. Played for the Pirates for the first half of the year and now plays for the Mets. I'm going to pull off the back here. We get a Julio Urias in the Generation Now and then a Salvi Perez. I um, guess I can cover the Red Sox with that card. Put this over to the side. Um, so Justin Upton, Daniel Vogelback, and Edward Cabrera. And I just ruined the surprise, but it is a Luis Robert. So I don't have this, and it's a blue parallel. Um, so the blue parallels are not numbered, as we saw with that Red Sox card. But regardless, I mean... That's not too bad. You figure we got three parallels out of this box. Uh, we only got one numbered, but we, so we got the one numbered Brett Phillips Tampa Bay Rays card, uh, and then the retail blue parallel again unnumbered, but of the Boston Red Sox um, team card, and then the manufacturer relic is not is not numbered, but a parallel as well. So three parallels out of one blaster. I'll take it. Um, obviously not the best parallels, but hey, it's a blaster box. What can you do? Um, but anyway, thank you very much for watching, and I will see you all in the next video. Bye, everyone.